hi everyone what is up i hope you guys are doing well i am just doing a little collective reading for you guys um i hope everything is great if you guys are interested in doing a reading with me lizzie tarot 1010 at gmail.com a lot of you guys have been emailing me it is first come first serve i have about four spots left my readings are strictly through the phone but my five dollar cash app questions are via email only my spell work is first come first serve as well i'm taking about six candle people this week i do money love open road um taking off black magic reversibles all that good stuff so just email me if you're interested so let's get into the reading because i'm talking too much so we did get spiritual attack guidance and dating so i feel like someone from your past is getting their karma um i feel like honestly uh the universe is like you know what you made your bed now lay in it and i feel like now they're facing their demons i feel like also um this person would always play games with you always play the victim always act like they were it was just you and them but it was always someone in the middle monkey in the middle there was always a girl a man more than once um more than one and more than once maybe they would sleep around with a lot of people and then they would kind of want to see you afterwards and then um string you along right i feel like you were guided to cut this person off and you listened and now i feel like you're you have a lot of faith and you're healing you're trusting your intuition you're paying attention to your dreams and i feel like now good things are happening to you things are going to be starting to unfold maybe you got a tarot reading or you're thinking about getting a tarot reading um and i feel like honestly your intuition was heightened with you dealing with this person a lot of dreams were letting you know i feel like you were having a dream about this you were having a dream about that maybe things that already happened you were trusting your gut you were trusting your intuition maybe for a little for a bit of you guys you guys were um like no i think i'm wrong they would never or you weren't believing people that were that you were getting tarot card readings from because you didn't see them that way this person wouldn't show you that they were like this right but i feel like everything is falling into place and this person is mad that you are back on the on the market you have a lot of options you're dating new you're having fun i feel like this person is stalking you and seeing if you are dealing with new people um and maybe they're going to tarot readers to be like hey like let me know what they're up to i feel like honestly even if you aren't dating anyone you're just really in this um happy energy like you finally left them you know that they're no good for you you're moving on you're excited for the bigger and better things um I, but i feel like this person's kind of holding tight onto you this person's probably trying to do love magic to you trying to self-sabotage um trying to block your blessings block your love is what i'm hearing yeah i feel like this person's trying to block your love for sure i feel like they're trying to make you feel like you don't want to be with anyone or you want to have trust issues or you want to run back to them but i feel like you've been single for a bit or you haven't talked to anyone serious since then and you're ready for new love you're like you you're in that energy like i want to get ready i want to you know have fun i already released the pain i already healed i already forgave i'm already like whatever's over it's over like we're just not meant to be and you accepted it so you're just like i'm ready for new but this person knows that and i feel like they try to cause a tower for you um trying to like not make you um want to date again or start new with someone or kind of get over them i feel like they wanted you to go over through the heartbreak again for you to be like oh my god i just missed them so much but i feel like you're like no you're varying your queen of swords energy varying your king of swords energy you're really being true to yourself um i don't want to say like you're in your queen of swords like bitterness but you're just like no no one's gonna come in here and manipulate my life or tell me what to do or try to control me you're just like no you're really in your power though for sure like happiness is here you're you're very in your healing feminine era i feel like a lot of you guys maybe have been very in your masculine very like what would you say very aggressive always wanting to try to start a fight or not letting them meet you in the middle um something in that in that nature is what i'm hearing but i feel like you're really working on your um like maybe you were kind of isolated you're wanting to go out more meet a lot of new people um and you're really working on your your money right now your stability your car your home fixing something really big like on a big project of good and better things right but i feel like you do have two paths right now um you have two decisions you have options to make 
um maybe they thought that the grass was greener on the other side and it's not and they got hit in the face so i feel like you knew that the grass wasn't greener on the other side and you still left with that without them um even if it hurt even if um you cried yourself at night you finally got justice for what you deserve right and i feel like since you love this person things are only going to be getting better back to back your wishes are going to be coming true money is going to be good getting good um you're healing you're happy you're healthy i'm hearing um a lot of you guys could be like reading a lot like reading a lot of books um trying new makeup trying a different look trying new perfume changing your wardrobe something really big and new let's see what else but i feel like this person's just worried about you <laughs> like literally worried about you is what i'm hearing i'm just worried about you right now but you're not worried about them i feel like honestly you don't want to talk to them you're not returning their calls you see them calling you're just not answering maybe they're trying to friend request you on social media or their friend is trying to like uh follow you or like a fake instagram i'm getting that type of energy um but i feel like honestly everything happened so pa so fast back then that you're just not willing to go back and re repeat history is what i'm hearing whatever happened happened and this person needs to get over it right let's see what else one more card yeah i feel like this person's trying to block your money heavy yeah i feel like they're trying to come back and show you that they're someone new but they're not i feel like even if they were to try to be like hey you know i changed let's get back they would start acting up again they would start acting up again yeah i feel like they do want to come back but they're coming back very very slow this person could be a libra uh aries a leo a sag a virgo a capricorn a taurus but you're just like no i'm done i made my decision i'm ready to leave this person all they would do is lie to your face act like it was just you but it wasn't i feel like now you're just getting good karma um and they're going through bad karma because this is what they get and now they're crying right who's crying now is what i'm hearing so that's all i have for you guys i hope you guys enjoyed i will see you guys in the next one don't forget to check out the description down below um, for all my other services and i will see you guys in the next one